Hey guys, um, this quick video, I've had a couple of people ask me how I hooked up the Fat Shark when I got it onto the Phantom. And it's, you know, one of the reasons I got the Fat Shark system is because it's, you know, beginner. Um, it's built basically for the beginner. It's very easy to do. Um, but I have had a couple of people ask me how to do it. Uh, so I'm just going to go over it very quickly. I've already done it on my, on my Phantom, so, you know. Things like the, uh, you know, the double-sided Velcro, um, you'll see it's already on there. But essentially, um, these are the parts that come with the kit. Um, this is the transmitter here, um, and this is the power. This is going to take power from the battery to the transmitter. Uh, the the whip antenna. One one of the whip antenna goes here. The other one goes on the goggles, battery that comes with it, the camera that comes with it, and then these are the, the cables that you use to connect it. Um, I don't use the camera that, that came with it. Um, I use the GoPro that's mounted directly uh, on the Phantom. In order to do that, I had to, to purchase a special cable. It's, you know, it's a $2 cable. Uh, I got it from uh, Hobby King. Um, and this basically allows me to connect from the GoPro to the transmitter and then use the video from that instead of having to use the camera. So what I'm going to do is show you how to hook it up with the camera that came with it um, and then hopefully I'll be able to show you a little bit of the video through the goggles but I'm not sure if, if that's going to work. Anyway, um, so to install it, really very, very simple. Just two-sided Velcro. I did uh, one side here, and then the other is going to go to the belly of the Phantom. Uh, just a little piece right there, and then basically, you know, boom, you're going to stick that guy right on there. But before I do that, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and show you how to hook up the, the, the wires. Um, it's really easy. <coughs> So, you've basically got, let me see if I can show you on this camera. Um, you've basically got, um, this is for the camera, that, the onboard camera that, that, that is supplied by, by the Fat Shark uh, kit. And then this is just going to go to the power. This is where the power comes in from the battery. Those are the only two connections. And then the antenna. So you got the, the camera, which is pre-wired. I'm going to show it to you now. And then the power. Okay, so this is the camera. The camera comes, you know, there's your camera, and this is the the uh, the lead that plugs into the back of it. It only goes in one way. You can't reverse it. You can't make a mistake with it. So it's going to come in this way, and you'll you'll see that it locks. Oops, there it goes, right there. That's it. That's on there. It's got a little lock. So there's only one way you can put this in. You can't mess this up. The other one, this is, the go to, this is going to go to the power. So I'm going to take one end. They're both the same, by the way. Both of these are the same. The other end goes here. So I'm going to take one end. Again, it only goes in one way. You can't reverse the cables. Real simple. That's essentially it. That's basically it. Now, I'm going to take this one off because in order to, to feed the cable through, um, I have a little uh, anti-vibration anti mount, and I won't be able to do it with the camera here. So I'm just going to take this off, and then I'll pull it back on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to feed the cables and then pull it back on. Okay, so there's the belly of my Phantom. I'm going to feed the antenna, I mean the camera cable, this way I get this guy out of the way, feed him through my mount, and then the other one is going to go the other way, so I've already got it, I'm going to go this way with this one. So this guy is going to go through this way. And then, real simple, just hook up 
the camera again it only goes in one way that guy's ready to go so I'm going to turn it around and actually stick it onto the velcro and boom that guy's ready to go now here we're going to put in the the uh, one of the whip antennas both of these guys are the same uh, best I can tell I, I can't find a difference between them so you just hook one of them up the other one's going to go to the goggles now <clears throat> like I said I'm going to hook this up and very important to note that uh, uh, they want you if you're going to test this out dry like this you got to have a you got to have antennas don't try and send a signal to your goggles without an antenna on the transmitter that my understanding is it can fry the whole thing so you make sure you put your antenna on the transmitter before you try and send a signal to your goggles all I need to do now is power it and, and get my goggles on so let's go ahead and stick the antenna on the goggles that's it I'm basically ready to receive I gotta hook up the battery to the goggles and I should be good there alright so this little piece here is the one that's actually gonna get the power so again this little piece goes on, this only goes in one way stick that in and you're basically ready to power it up now I'm gonna assume I'm gonna pretend like the battery is I'm gonna put, put in the battery and everything I can't do everything because I, I'm actually waiting on a replacement because I broke a little latch on this guy but I'll stick the battery in there and I'll go ahead and give it power just so that you can see it hook my battery up to the goggles yes Berto we know you're there okay now I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this there's no signal obviously because I haven't powered it yet so you should see that there's nothing there I don't think you're gonna be able to see it much out of me but there's no signal it should be just snow and let me check that yep just snow okay but now I'm gonna power it and as soon as I do I should get a signal again this is the three cell. you've got basically uh, four cell two cell three cell phantom uses a three cell battery so you're going to use the three cell connector okay this guy now has power so I actually well I'm gonna to have to take my lens cap off the camera but I should see something and I do see if I can get that in there so that you guys can see I'm gonna take my camera I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that but the camera basically is working at this point you, you already have video you're seeing video through the goggles I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that but we'll see anyway that's essentially all there is to it um, to hook up the the GoPro camera the only thing you're going to do is replace this cable with this one this end goes in to the transmitter part and this goes to your GoPro simple as that it's a two dollar cable this works very well by the way I've never even used the camera that comes with it but this works very well I think that covers it. I, like I said, there's not much to it. Uh, it's very simple to do. Believe me, if I'm not a do, I'm not a a DIYer. A lot of people, you know, do it yourself with the electronics and the welding. I don't do any of that stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm. <laughs> uh, believe me, if I can do it, anybody can do it. Uh, okay. Thanks for watching. Uh, questions, comments, uh, suggestions, by all means. Um, please like the video if you enjoyed it. Uh, Subscribe, it's free.